Don't be sad. Okay, I'm so sad. It's so emotional lately. Like, no, it's okay. Guys, I'm not always emotional like this. Okay, I don't know why I'm always emotional, but. Let there be light. What's poppin' T squad? Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to the Rush Fam. fam. Welcome, Welcome back, back to another vlog. <laughs> What's poppin' guys? Welcome back to another video. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's a beautiful sunny day, so we need everyone to go subscribe because if you ain't with the squad, you, you ain't popping, popping, and you're definitely gonna wanna be popping on this video. Good morning, babe. I got a question for you before we start Good this morning, vlog. mom and dad. Nana said that I took a big sleep. You did take a big sleep, but I got a I question took for mommy. a big sleep, yes, babe. How do you wake up first thing in the morning looking this beautiful? Like, I, I don't get Honestly, it. Honestly, like, guys, let me just how? say something real quick, okay? So, you guys remember the last video? I had the allergic reaction going on with my eyebrows. Mm -hmm. Well, now, I feel like my... My, not only my eyebrows are better now, but my whole face got you're, like... You're reborn. Yeah, like, I don't know. Reborn. Sometimes I wake up and I'm like... I'm like, what's changed? Yeah. Like, my whole face looks you look so beautiful. great. Yo, you're the definition of like waking up like this. You wake up like already look Literally. like you got makeup on, like you popping, babe. So, I love you. Honestly, I'm just so thankful that whatever the dermatologist gave me not mm. only fixed my eyebrows but gave my whole face a glow. So thank you, girl. You did that. But yeah, look at my I'm back, y'all. Beautiful wife, beautiful daughter. Anyways, y'all, we got so much to share with you guys. We got a, a dope vlog for y'all. But we are starting the day with something a little bit sad, you know? That's the thing about visiting and family. Babe, can you agree? Like, it's always so dope to see family. You know, we've had, we've had our family staying with us for several weeks now. Several months, actually, for part of them, babe. Yeah, I know. So it's been a long, amazing visit here in Florida. But it is the day, y'all. It is time for our family to go home. And it's kind of sad. Callie, you yeah. sad? Babe, you sad or? Yeah, like I love, you know, we love having company. We love having our family here, you know, but the time has come and it is what it is. It that's is how, that's how is. trips yeah. and visits are. Like you enjoy it, the time goes, and then you wait for the next one, you know? Exactly. But they'll be back. They'll be back. Of course so. they'll be back. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Callie, how you feel? You sad, girl? Mm -hmm. You sad? Don't be sad, okay? You should cry. Send us notes. It's never, you know, it's the cliche thing they say in the movies. It's not goodbye, it's, it's see you later. later. So we're gonna let you guys say goodbye as well. I think Camaro's really sad because he's about to be, him and Eli are just bonding so much, you know what I'm saying? They're like, you know, a boy thing, but anyways, let's go say goodbye to them, y'all. All right, you guys, it is that time. You know, so, it's kind of sad. My nephew, Camaro's, Camaro and Kelly and Kira's cousin, nephew, we're going to miss you, bro. We're, we're going to miss you so much. But, yo, it's been a great visit. We were just talking about that downstairs. You know, that's how visits are. They come, they're fun, they go, but then you get to do it again. You know what I'm saying? Over yeah. and over again. Over and over again. We love you, kiddo. Did you have a good trip here? Yeah. You loved it? Yeah. You ready to go home though? Mm -hmm. The thing is, you guys, Elijah has to get home because this guy needs to get back on his ball practices. You need to get back to your basketball. Oh, that's how it is? Oh, that's how it is. You got a whole lot of practice to do when you get home, right? Yeah. Are you guys sad? Yeah, I'm sad. I'm gonna miss you. Oh. Same. Y'all so cute, man. We love you, Eli. We'll see you soon, all right? All right. You guys, look at Kiki. Are you helping Nana's bag go downstairs? She's Auntie's bag. What's Auntie's bag? Auntie's helper. Kira's helping pack. Aww. Aww. Chantel's getting emotional. I cannot really tell y'all. Chantel's getting emotional. This could be emotional for all of us. 
Good morning. Good morning. Say what's popping, T Squad? Popping, T Squad. Hey. Mommy's got a butterfly, butterfly on her shirt. And I was already gonna tell you guys in this vlog, but I guess since she's here, we'll tell you guys no. now. I don't know if she knew. Butterfly blue. It's blue. Yes. Honestly, ever since that vlog, you guys, it's almost like her her stuttering and stammering is is gone. It's like magically like, after that vlog. We've we've noticed it so much, and I'm like, is it just me or is she not doing it anymore? Like hardly at all. She'll do it. Okay, what? I'm not I'm mommy not talking. talking. Mommy's talking. Mommy's talking. Huh? The secret? Oh, she's gonna tell me a secret. Oh, that's why you were stuttering? <laughs> you, she, what did you say? Because you're too smart? Um, you guys! You guys! You guys? <laughs> Is it because yeah. everyone was sending good wishes Please. for you? One, two, two. three! Yeah. Oh, she's, yeah. she's doing the intro for Famous Two Family. Yeah. Yeah. Are, am, are you beautiful? No. I'm what? Just, yes, you are. Two. You're two. But guess two. what? You're two and you're beautiful. You guys! <laughs> yeah, but as I was saying, you guys, I don't know if she knew or I honestly don't know. But since that video, it's honestly down to a very, very, very low minimum. She's not doing it as like hard and excessively as she was before. And I feel like since then her vocabulary has expanded even more. Like she's saying like super big sentences, bigger words. What is that? What is that? What did you just put in your mouth? Um, Can I see? Open. Uh, what is that? Anyway, I guess she got snacks on the floor, but yeah, so I just want to say once again I know you guys already you know sent well wishes and everything like that, but honestly, it's gone, right? Do you have anything you want to tell them? I uh, no. You don't know? Uh, um, my teeth. Your teeth? Oh no. Oh no. Uh, get it off. Did you have a good sleep last night? Oh uh, no. No? Why are you putting that in your mouth? Oh no. Oh no, you don't like it now? Oh That's no. why you don't eat things off the floor. Will you dump that now? Okay. What are you doing? Oh no. Did you have a good sleep though? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, listen. We have to go say bye to Nana. Uh. Nana's gonna go home. You know that? Yay! Yay? Yummy, gone. Oh, you got it out your mouth. Are you gonna miss Nana as much as I am? Yeah, mommy. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go give her a hug. Oh, you are trying to help Nana? This morning she came looking for Carly. She did. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Do you want to help? Let's because help. Carly came in yeah, about yeah. soon. Well, don't worry, cause we got two big helpers. Come on, we got you. Oh my gosh, you're so strong. Yes. Yes. So strong. You think you can do it by yourself? Uh, yes. Oh my gosh, no, I was just joking. <laughs> All right, Shanti wanted to have a last hurrah. She's like, I gotta take this drink, y'all. We gotta drink. <laughs> we, we, don't, we don't usually turn up early in the day, but we you know. We don't, but you know. I'm going back to the Chantel city. Chantel usually doesn't, so for her to say she wants a little something is... Just a little pig before I leave, you know, hey. I don't want to get too emotional, but you so, know. Give me a hug, sis, I'm gonna miss know. you. Right? I'm don't worry, I'll be back so soon you guys know it. Of course. Yeah, right. I'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> I got this one in my arms. She doesn't want to feel left out. <laughs> oh. We're gonna miss saw. everybody. Mommy. Chantel. No, sis. Can you give us your hug? Oh, don't be sad. Okay, I'm so sad and so emotional lately. <laughs> no, I'm not. It's okay. Guys, I'm not always emotional like this, okay? I don't know why I'm always emotional, but. This is my sister, my brother, my, my kids. I'm, these are my kids right here, so. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Eli, it's okay, boy. It's okay, Eli. You're going to be back before you know it. Okay. And Callie's crying. It's like a chain reaction right, right? now. Right? Okay. It's okay, baby. Callie, you can call me every single day, okay? Okay. Call me every day, okay? Okay, Callie. Call every day, okay? 
We can watch scary movies together. We'll face from each other and watch scary movies together and watch the same movie on, on our TV, okay? Promise? Yes, I'm good, thank you. Okay, come give me a hug. Aww. Eli, give me another hug, bro. We're gonna see Hold you on, look, Kiki's, Kiki's comforting him. It's okay, we can all give him a hug. Mm -hmm. Love you, Eli. Kira, Kira, give him a hug. Give him a nice hug. Okay, let's take the shot, just like so a <laughs> <laughs> hug, Eli. Aww. No, because Pally was crying and I was crying. Don't worry, buddy. You'll be back before we know it, okay? Don't worry. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Mom. Thank you for everything you helped us with. Thank you for your company, your good vibes. And the cooking. Can't forget the, <laughs> the bomb food Nana was making. Yeah. Well, you'll be back before you know it. And give Nana a hug. Now Kiki's sad, too. I this vlog can be this sad. Bro. Right? Oh. Y'all can make me See, cry. I know. When I, first came to, when I first came to Miami, I cried because I've seen them. Yeah. And then Kelly started crying, and now I'm crying because I'm leaving. But it's okay because they're not gone forever. Exactly. Or one phone call away. Exactly. Or one so, flight so away. Exactly. It's, it's or not, one flight it's never away. Goodbye. No. See you no. Later. no. Exactly. <laughs> but don't worry guys, you guys can still see Eli on his channel. Yeah. Eli's fun world. Eli's been posting them bangers though, right? <laughs> <sighs> that was so emotional, you guys. First Kelly started crying, then Chantel started crying, then Eli started crying, then Nana started crying, then me and Keisha almost started crying. Almost started, but we didn't cry, but that was super emotional, you guys. <sighs> But don't worry, y'all will see them back soon, you guys. You, you guys already know what it is. You can't keep family apart for too long. I know a lot of people are missing their families. I miss my mom, my dad, and my brother, my cousin as well. Haven't literally seen them much at all since COVID started, you guys. It's just been crazy, as I know it has for a lot of y'all. But we gonna get through it together, you guys. Also, for those of y'all that know me and know the details about my life, y'all know that my birthday just passed. My birthday was actually yesterday, you guys. So, you know, I appreciate everyone that, you know, came to my Instagram and told me happy birthday. I truly appreciate it, y'all. This year for my birthday, I did something completely different. Um, if y'all been following us for a while, you guys know that usually for our birthdays, we take like big extravagant trips, we get super lit and we stay at crazy hotels. But this year, y'all, you know, because we had just recently moved to Miami, I wanted to just kind of have a low key birthday. So me and Keisha had a hotel downtown Miami. We ate at some really nice restaurants. And then last night on my birthday as well, we came home and celebrated with the kids. They surprised me with like uh, edible arrangements, with um, a cake, with decorations. And it was just a really fun family vibe. Then after that, you guys, I have to show y'all this. My wife went and outdid herself like she does every year. We always try to outdo her each other, but oh my gosh i have to show you guys oh prepare your eyes right because this might this might give you a headache this might make you dizzy so this is what my wife got me for my birthday y'all this is a rolex sky dweller y'all this is a extremely extremely crazy rolex not like a regular rolex as you can see all iced out it's beautiful she even got the big diamonds on there that's crazy she really went above and beyond me and Keish love our watches so this is super dope thank you so much baby i was not expecting it y'all because like i told you it was a low-key birthday and the night was literally almost done there was maybe an hour left to my birthday and she came and surprised me with this and you guys know i love my gold so it just goes with all my jewelry absolutely crazy i love it and also y'all you guys know that every year for my birthday, I have to give like a little small birthday speech, all right? A birthday spiel, a birthday motivation, whatever you wanna call it. Every once in a while, I like to tell you guys stuff that goes on in my mind and stuff that motivates me that I don't always share, but every once in a while, you know, I like to give you guys the real deal about how I feel about life and things that motivate me. So as y'all know, like we've had, you know, crazy success on YouTube in our, in our professional careers and I wanna go back to before that, y'all, because I always say the most important thing is happiness, all right? I, th I feel like people should strive to find happiness in the things that don't cost money, in nature, in relationships, in love, in friendships. Those are the things you should fall in love with. Those are the things you should find your happiness in. Then when you get to the bag, when you make your money, when you become successful, it just enables you the time and the freedom to do more of what you love. 
So I don't feel like we should fall in love with the material items or fall in love with the money itself, but rather the other things that come free and then the money and the success will enable you to do more of what you love. So that's what I'm all about. You know, it's dope to get amazing gifts and have, you know, all this stuff, but you gotta have the happiness from the other stuff, from the things that don't cost no money. Then everything you get on top of that, it's like an added bonus. And for me, having the financial success and the financial freedom for me and Keisha, it enables us to do more of what we love, you know, spend time with our family, be out in nature, helping people, traveling and seeing the world. And those are the things that truly bring us happiness. And to everyone watching this that's like not motivated or depressed, we always like to tell y'all that you guys can do anything. We, we like to showcase our lives and our story and tell you guys about how we came up to motivate y'all because you can really do this too. It doesn't have to be YouTube. If you wanna be a doctor, a dentist, you wanna be a basketball player, an athlete, or you wanna be a, a CEO of a company, or you wanna have you know a great job and do overtime and make lots of money, anything you wanna do, you can do it, but it all starts with the mind state. You gotta be focused and find your happiness before the success, and then you're gonna put yourself in a vibration to be able to go out and attain the success. Put yourself in the right energy, put yourself in the right vibration to be able to go out and do what you wanna do in your life. But that's what's up you guys, another year. Your boy's getting kinda of old, all right? I still feel young, I don't feel old, but I'm getting older, all right? Your boy turned 32. For those of you guys that wanna know, I'm 32. But I feel amazing, I feel like I'm aging backwards. You know, my skin is glowing, I got my teeth, I'm growing back out my hair. Um, and I just feel great, you guys. I feel like I'm getting younger, and it's a mind state thing. Whoa. Kira, where are you going? Come inside. Closing the door. Yeah. Over is here, the babe something? is making something. Babe, what are you building right now? Uh, this is a little pink car for Kiki. Okay. Busy. Okay. Yeah. Kiki, mommy's building you a new car? Yeah! Yeah? A brand new car! A new car! Hey, whoa, whoa! Hey, nice jumping, Kira. Nice jumping. <laughs> You guys, last night, I don't think anyone wished me happy birthday more than Kira. Kira would not stop saying happy birthday. And babe, I was just talking about like my low-key birthday and how amazing it was to spend it with family. Yeah. And I showed them the gift you got me, so thank you, babe. Uh, you went all out. You know? <laughs> I, had, I had to, you know, pay you back because you got me such a nice gift for my birthday last year. Facts. But it was a vibe. This was like one of the first times where I've done like a stay at home, low key birthday in a long time. Really and it chill. felt really good. It yeah, felt really, really good. Facts. Camille, how you feel, bro? Everyone's still kind of sad. Are you good? Yeah, I'm good. You're not too sad? No. I'm nah. just sad that I don't have anyone to play basketball with. I'll anymore. play basketball with you, bro. Okay. Yeah, don't worry. I got you, bro. So that's kind of going to be the vibe for today, you guys. Everyone's like a little bit down, a little bit sad that our family left. <laughs> what? Why do I got to hush? Huh? Because it's Because it's my birthday? Oh, I gotta close my eyes. Okay. Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh, my Kira wants to show you guys my cake. Uh huh. Oh, my cake. All right, so it is like half eaten. You want to eat it? Oh my gosh, careful. Oh, there we go. You okay? So as you can see, it's half eaten, but this is my favorite type of cake. They got me the red velvet. It said happy birthday tray on there. Kira enjoyed the cake more happy than anyone. Birthday, Daddy. Hey. Happy birthday, Daddy. Hey. Hey, thank you, baby. Oh, wow, okay. Do your thing, Kira, do your thing. And it's not like we're not gonna see Eli, cause look, he just left and he's already on the TV, bro. He's already on the TV. Callie looks sad. It's okay, girl. We miss you already, Eli, Chantel, and Nana. We miss y'all. T-Squad. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Me neither. We don't, we don't know what to say. We're like, today feels like a very emotional vlog. Mm -hmm. It feels like it's bittersweet, but Nipsey, what are you doing, bro? He's hype. Why are you so hype, bro? I think he misses Chantel and Eli and Nana already. I was hiding under your porch because I love you. Are you looking for them? Are you looking for them? Are you looking for them? You guys, Nipsey actually bonded so much with all of them, especially Chantel. Nipsey and Chantel have a bond. Whenever I'm not home, Chantel will actually walk Nipsey for me and they have a really special bond. But anyways, y'all, Camaro, how do you feel about like when family visits and then they go home? Does it make you sad? Or are you just, you know, excited to see them again later? How do you feel? Makes me feel like this. Okay. 
Aw, all right, that's how it makes Camaro feel. But anyways, T-Squad, I think this is gonna end up the vlog. Um, me and Camaro are just gonna be having some father-son time. I gotta go to my appointment, and Keisha and the girls are going to a party. It's actually Melly's birthday, so shout out to Beam Squad. Shout out to Melly, happy birthday. Um, but yeah, you guys, we love y'all. Thanks for coming back and watching another vlog. Come hey! On. Aren't you gonna come end the vlog with me, bro? Yeah, what? We honestly love you, T-Squad, and I think I could be wrong, but I think, oh my gosh, how did I just remember this? What? This is the first vlog we put out since we hit two mil on the Rush Fam. Ooh, yeah. Oh my gosh, you guys, I almost ended the video without addressing it. And we gotta say thank you guys, man. We hit thank two you. million on the Rush Fam. That's crazy. Obviously, we have all these subscribers on our other channels. You know, Famous Tube Family almost has four million. But this is also very special because the Rush Fam was our first channel, y'all. Mm -hmm. So to our finally hit- Channel. Our first channel yes. ever. Well, as y'all know, it was today with Trey and then we changed it to the Rush Fam. But two milli on the Rush Fam, guys, is very special to us. It's like, it's like our baby, our first ever channel. So honestly, thank you guys to all the day one subscribers, all the new subscribers, mm -hmm. all the people in between. We love all y'all. You guys are the best, man. We would not be here without y'all. So we appreciate it. And for anyone who's watching this video, y'all should be a part of the gang now, part of the squad, because we two milli deep. So make sure you subscribe, because if you ain't with the squad, you ain't popping! Hey, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, 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 peace.